yes to prevention, no to panic. What can you do right now to prevent getting the coronavirus? I want to help you in this video by giving you steps that you can take right now so you can contain the coronavirus, prevent from getting it, reduce your tension, reduce the panic, reduce the fear, and boost your immune system so you can contain, prevent, and not get the coronavirus. We are all dealing with the pandemic of the coronavirus. However, the pandemic of fear, tension, and stress is bigger than the pandemic of the coronavirus. So what can you do to reduce the fear, the tension, the anxiety, the stress in these days so you can boost and increase your immune system, which you really, really need to fight and prevent the coronavirus? Make sure you stay till the end of this video because I have a free gift for you, an offer, an action step that you can take right now. Now, more than ever, it is important to address the topic of fear. Now, more than ever, it is important to address the anxiety, the mental health, and know and understand the importance of our mind, our thoughts, and how it creates fear. The fear that we do not want and need right now, the fear that we have to keep to a low, low, low minimum so we can have a good, strong immune system to boost and prevent the coronavirus. We are all dealing with the coronavirus and it causes fear and we feel that fear. It is also widely known that what we feel, we tend to manifest. If we fear, it is the strongest, most powerful emotion, stronger than any positive thought that we can even think. Now, if we fear in mass, in masses all around the world, this could manifest our worst case scenario. So please understand that your fear, your emotion, what you feel, you can manifest. And so keep that fear to a minimum. How? That's what I'm going to talk about. Because now, more than ever, it is important to address the topic of fear, the power of our thoughts. I make a lot of videos about that topic, how to overcome fear, because it goes down to the bottom line. You have to overcome the fear, and the fear is caused by our thoughts. And this is a serious matter. And our body and our mind connection, it is also widely known. Our body and our mind are so connected with each other, what you think you become, what you think you create, your thoughts create your reality. I cannot repeat that enough. And in these days with the coronavirus, what we think, what we panic, the thoughts, the fear, it causes our body to react to that in fear. Fear means tension. Fear means anxiety. Fear means stress to our body which is caused by our mind, which is all connected. Body and mind are connected. Our thoughts feed into all of our cells in our body. It is so important to understand that because that is what also decreases our immune system, which we need to resist any virus, any illness, any disease. So that's why it's so important to take the necessary steps to prevent that, to contain the virus to a minimum. And if you can help yourself, you are helping others as well. So what are these steps that you can take? Drink plenty of water, eat healthy foods, isolate yourself as much as you can. If you cannot be in contact with others, you risk getting the virus or spreading the virus. So try to isolate yourself no matter where in the world you are. Add ginger to your diet. Add vitamin C to your diet. <laughs> last but not least, and not even last, but wash your hands a lot, regularly. Maintain good hygiene. Stress management, super important. Go out and walk in nature. Be outside. If you can, be outside, breathe the air. There is nothing wrong with the air outside. In fact, it's really, really good for you. 
try to move your body to exercises in any kind of way whether you're inside at home or outside try to go outside as much as you can but if you're inside don't just sit still and do nothing your body needs exercise your blood has to flow I love going to the gym. I cannot go to the gym right now. It's closed and I wouldn't even go. I try to isolate myself. I'm a social creature. You're a social creature. We all are social creatures. We need social contact. So whether you're alone in your home, just like I am, try to stay connected. This is huge. There are so many people vulnerable to get depressed, depressions, a mental condition, which is serious it can lead to suicide. Let's not go, even go there. I don't want to be too dramatic at all. I just take this very, very serious. You can do a lot of things to stay connected, even if you're alone in your home, just like me. I'm talking to you. This is my way of getting connected. It's one of the ways to get connected. Now, I, don't, I know you're not all going to make videos or, or lives or whatnot, but you can pick up the phone, you can Skype, you can WhatsApp, you can go online, Facebook, Messenger, all of these ways to get in contact with your family, your friends or other people, anybody. You can even contact me. Tell me, tell me what's going on. Tell me what, what you fear. Let me help you get you unstuck. I am here to help you. I'm reaching out. I'm offering help because I want this as much as you do to pass by, to go away. Nobody's asking for this virus, but it all has meaning. Maybe this is a lesson for us to stay connected with ourselves, with others in all other ways. It's a way to think out of the box. How can you stay connected? What can you do? How can you be of help? How can you be of service? But let's keep a healthy mental health. It is crucial for our body, for our main health. It's crucial to prevent this virus to get to us. It's crucial for us to spread the virus. Let's contain it. Let's reduce the panic, reduce the tension, reduce the stress, reduce the anxiety, boost our immune system. Stay healthy, stay happy. This will pass. But you can do so many things to stay healthy, to help others, to stay connected. Take these steps. It is crucial. I want you to comment below. What are you doing? What are the steps that you are doing? What are steps that you can add besides everything that I said to make sure that you contain the virus, that you stop it, to make sure that you lower your fears, that your thoughts are positive and strong so you manifest more positivity in your life and not the fear or the worst case nightmare. Let's do this together, you and I. So comment below, please. I have also created a free gift, which is a download of changing and rephrasing your thoughts. It is crucial, crucial in this time. But also, please comment below and talk to me. I am here to help you. If you have fear, if you are stuck, if you need connection, if you want to get out of a certain situation, please, please, please talk to me. I am here and I'm happy to go on a call with you. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.